Okay, here we have Sonos the wireless hi-fi system, the bridge unit. So this unit has no amplifier, it has no speakers, and it has no audio output. It's literally um, a unit that allows you to bridge your network to create the Sonos net. Now the Sonos net is the uh, Sonos's own uh, wireless uh, music system. It's a peer-to-peer -peer mesh network. So typically what you would do with the bridge is you'd be connecting either directly to your router let me just get the uh, instruction card that the unit comes with out of the way or if you have a larger home network um, a hub or a switch in your house so I'm going to just quickly do that literally it's a cat5 lead plug it into the back there goes the box so yeah stand that out of the way and into the back of the router in this example you can plug it in and immediately have established your Sonos system connected to the internet therefore you have access to all the internet music services etc that you uh, that you want to uh, enabling your house and any other Sonos system that you then add to it to be able to play music streamed over the internet or from your home network uh, of course you can have any combination of this typically the router in most people in most people's homes is uh, the uh, is also the uh, the little hub switch. This one has a four port hub switch built into it, similar to this uh, five port uh, switch I have here. That's separately. Other people have units, larger networks where they've daisy chained these already together, and uh, you can connect your Sonos bridge into either your network switch or your router. Doesn't matter which. Okay, so this will establish um, the Sonos net, and once you have that. You can then expand your Sonos system, adding uh, what, through the wireless Sonos net um, any other units like the Play 5, the Play 3, etc., etc., um, or indeed the uh, Sonos wireless dock. Okay.